Now, your local weather authority with meteorologist Dan Reynolds. Cloudy enough out there as we look at the Great Bear Post Building, Skywatch Network camera, school forecast, 7 o'clock to your home, looks pretty good. 28, bit of wind chill at 22. Under partly cloudy skies, though the clouds are rolling in pretty quickly. It's 31 in Terre Haute, feels like 24 with that north northeast wind at 7. Pressure up there, rising from 30.35. 32 Paris, 32 Robinson. So, cool start, but a little above what we had yesterday. Winds <clears throat> fairly light. They'll be out of the west today at 5 to 10, so just a hint of a wind chill. Take a look at the Metro V as you head out. We'll see the clouds on the increase as we go into the afternoon hours, if not before. <clears throat> Tim's steadily rising, too, once we get past sunrise there. Headed for another day in the 40s. Somebody might hit the 50 mark, southern sections. Big picture. Man, looks like we could have some pretty good snow out here in the central plains. For us, the Gulf's wide open. There's a cold front coming. So the setup for us is for showers with a few thunderstorms after midnight. You'll already see the clouds pretty much working their way through. And note the track of that snowfall up to the northeast. We won't worry about that. We're going to warm up. I'd say Saturday, somebody's going to hit the 60-degree mark out there. Future cast, put things in motion. The clouds pretty much overrun the area by afternoon, if not sooner. Then watch as we go past midnight into Saturday morning. That's 3.15 a.m. Eastern. Rain just starting to show up. Spotty down to the south. Put things in motion, get into the morning hours, starts to work its way through by the afternoon. Big surge of rain with that frontal boundary kicking through. All the rain's going to be gone by the time you start your day on Sunday. In fact, I think probably, oh, a little past midnight, we'll get rid of that rain. Now, the good news, we're not going to have severe weather, it doesn't look like. The shading here, that's general thunderstorm activity. You don't worry about that. You go down here to this darker shading, that's marginal threat of severe storms, which is the low end of the severe scale. Further south is where there's a slight risk, so that's an improved picture for us. And rainfall amounts out of this could get some one inch plus amounts here and there around the valley, so it could be a pretty decent rainfall in less than 24 hours. And there goes that system through. And once that one's pushed on through, we'll dry off for a while. Keep an eye to the sky on Wednesday, see if we need to put something in there, but right now we're going to keep that dry as well. Now, as far as today, 47. A cool day, but not too bad. Mostly cloudy, just an east wind at 5 to 10. 36 tonight, really, that's pretty mild. If you're going out, you'll be okay during the evening. You'll be rain-free. The rain comes in after midnight. Then, as we look ahead, a rainy Saturday with a few thunderstorms. 59 for the high, big cold front. We cool down quite a bit. 40 degrees Sunday, and Dana, hang on to your hat Sunday. Winds gusting to 45. Mm, all right, a little extra hairspray.